when Spurs' Chris Paul gets rematch against Warriors. What Chris Paul's first matchup against the Warriors in 2024-25 represents. They didn't part on bad terms, nor is there known bad blood between involved individuals. But when the San Antonio Spurs meet the Golden State Warriors, it gives Chris Paul a chance to take on the team that let him walk after a one-year experiment. While the future Hall of Famer has been a bit of a journeyman over the last several years, the Bay Area was supposed to essentially represent a last stop for the now 39-year-old. Enter Greg Popovich and Victor Wembanyama, the chance he calls an honor and a privilege to play for a man he says he's admired was a huge carrot for Paul. Along with playing for Pop, teaming with Wemby provided another draw for the 12-time All-Star. He'll help lead his new squad against the sixth franchise for which he played come late November. When Chris Paul welcomes his most recent team, the first of three scheduled games against the Warriors happens on November 23. After that, Barring a meeting in the Emirates NBA Cup, it'll be four months before they face off again. The Golden State trade for Paul last summer ended their relationship with Jordan Poole. It came a couple of weeks after the Phoenix Suns moved Paul to the Washington Wizards in the Bradley Beal deal, meaning the Dubs looked at Paul as a piece they hoped would get them back in contention after they'd won the 2022 NBA championship. At 46-36, the Warriors did improve by two wins last regular season, but unlike the year before, they didn't reach the playoffs thanks to a play-in loss to the same Sacramento Kings franchise they beat in a thrilling seven-game first-round series. In 2023, with an aging core, general manager Mike Dunleavy Jr. changed course this summer. While Paul entered free agency, Clay Thompson is now with the Dallas Mavericks via trade. The Saturday before Thanksgiving will not only pit Paul against Steph Curry and Draymond Green for the first time in 2024 to 2025, but it will also mark a first look at guys like Kyle Anderson, Buddy Heald, and DeAnthony Melton now that the Warriors feature a different look. It's an opportunity for the Wake Forest alum to remind Golden State about what they no longer have. At the same time, it could also prove indicative of what they no longer are. Paul's first dates with other old flames. Throughout his career, the consensus all-time top 10 point guard has also suited up for the then New Orleans Hornets, Los Angeles Clippers, Houston Rockets, Oklahoma City Thunder, and Suns. Here's a look at Paul's first games against each of those teams. On February 7, the Spurs visit the Hornets. On November 4, they visit the Clippers. The Rockets are the opponents in San Antonio's first two home games of the season on October 26 and 28. Two nights later, the Spurs are at the Thunder. An Emirates NBA Cup contest at Phoenix is scheduled for December 3. It's not quite the goodbye tour the 11-time All-Pro and two-time Olympic gold medalist will experience if, when the time comes, he announces pending retirement as he's still playing. But, for now, it's emblematic of one of the great NBA careers.